गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन एम आई ऑडिबल कैन यू हेयर मी डियर फ्रेंड्स ये स्टडी वी हैव डिस्कस्ड वेरी बेसिक थिंग्स अबाउट द बर्थ ऑफ यन एंड या so we have started our discussion yesterday that what is the secret of this universe whether you want to do the treatment so the meaning of treatment means correction of energy correction of chi or you want to do feng shui or the vastu vastu means you are correcting the correction of the chi of home where you are living so if you know the secret of this universal energy you can do everything and you can correct the alignment whether the alignment of your home or the alignment of your energy definitely right now our focus is how to balance health so for that we should know the concept of i ching which is given by three saints or we can tell the saints were fuxi and the fuxi has given a trigram first we are focusing on the a trigram first we are disclosing the secret of a trigram then the king vein of ju has divided this a trigram a trigram in the 64 hexagrams then confucius has simplified it so our first target to try to understand this a trigram right if you see many we are learning the acupuncture we are learning acupressure we are learning the energy system and we are showing this trigram in a different different way for example sometime we are showing the tri tri this eight trigram in this way we are giving them very simple name like the bind heat hotness brightness humidity dryness coldness darkness these are simplified names what the eight energies in the eight energy one is the father energy one is the mother energy right so what is the father energy what is the mother energy and other are son and daughter right and if you see there is another form to so the trigram we can see this is the another way so this is the yin and yang so we can see 1 2 3 4 Five, six, seven, and eight. This is the another way to show the eight trigrams. We will be coming to that point. Just I am giving you little idea, right? And if we know the turtle, even if you show the wake of the turtle, right? so when we are learning the turtle acupuncture or when we are doing the turtle acupuncture we know we are making in that way right on the back of the turtle we are writing in that way we are writing certain number 4 9 2 3 right? 7 6 
three, five. This is also the concept of I chain. The center can be considered as a yin and yang. And other we can see there are eight diagrams. So let's see, try to learn that how these all things has originated. So the concept of a trigram given by Fuxi, right? Then it has been expanded in the 64. 64 is the great secret of energy. You can invest your many years to understand this energy. If you look at the India, in the India, there is a 64 forces. In the India, there are 64 forces. We are telling 64 yogini. And we are doing worship. And while doing the worship of 64 yogini, the yogini number one for this power, yogini number two for this energy, yogini number three for that power, yogini number four for another power. So whatever we want, we can achieve by the 64 yogini. What is 64 yogini? 64 yogini is the expansion of this eight trigram. But in the India, there is a different style. Our scent has presented everything in a different style. But in the China, they are called 64 tri hexagrams. So 64 hexagram presented by King Venus Zhu. And it was really very surprising. He found the secret of whole universe is in the 64 hexagrams. Suppose you are suffering with some problem. Then you can correct the problem. If you are suffering with poverty, you can attract the wealth. And if you are suffering with some disease, you can attract the health just by balancing the 64 hexagrams. Initially, we will try to learn a trigram. Right? Confucius has simplified these all things. So today we can understand everything. So 64 hexagram has been presented in this way. There are total six lines, right? So we have come to this point. There are two universal forces, Yang, which is unbroken line. And the yin, which is broken line. This is step number one, right? Yang can be considered as a male force and the yin can be considered as a female force. So from the nothingness, what appear first? Yang and yin, right? Then the, in the step number two, they have further divided. Okay. Yang divided in male and female. Yin also multiplied in the male and female. So in this way, so we can see this is the young plus young. So this is the male character. So young divided into part male plus female. Yin also divided into part male and female, but we are telling them yin and yang, right? So you can see here, Taya means young plus young, maximum young. We are young and young is there, there is a no yin, meaning Taya. On the other side, on the other peak, we can see Taya yin means yin plus yin. Because unbroken line means yin, right? 
and in between we see there is this. So look at once again. So ultimately two force, two forces become four forces. Like two energies become four energies. So we can see here Tai Yang, this is the Yang. Shao Yin is the Yin. Shao Yang is the Yang. And Tai Yin is the Yin. So we can see when there is a multiplication. In the equal quantity, Yang and Yin force are taking the worth. Right. So till here we already have discussed yesterday. We already discussed the name like the first is called Tai Yang, which is the maximum Yang. The last is called Tai Yin, means the maximum Yin. In the Tai Yang, we just have Yang and Yang, no Yin. In the Tai Yin, we are having just Yin and Yin, no Yang. So we are telling them maximum Yang. and the maximum yin. And with that, there is, yin, there is a worth of Shao Yin and the Shao Yang. Right? So there are four energies has been created, but we have to reach till the eight energies. Now every energy will create two, 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 two energies then we'll reach on the eight energy. So now this is the step number next, because if we want to plan any treatment, if we want to plan anything, at least we need eight energy. So in this way, now Yang is giving worth to two male and two female. Yin is also giving worth to to male and to female. So this is the entire family is your taking worth. This is the entire family. The family of eight member, right? So we can see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We can consider this the one family having eight member, like in your family, you might be having five member, four member, six member, eight member, 10 members. In the same, this family is having eight members. And yin and yang force in the equal quantity. Here we are having two male, two female. Here we are having two male, two female. So finally, I can tell four male and the four female. Four are yang force and the four are yin force. So there are total number is eight. Or I can simply <clears throat> define in this way. So this is the, my family of the eight member. This is a family of eight member, right? Eight member family. So this is the center, okay. <clears throat> okay, now. So we can say this is the father. Here is the mother. Then we are having son, right? And we are having daughters. Even on the other side, we are having, we are having son. So what I want to tell you, just you do the counting. Suppose the half is young. Suppose the half is young. And the half is yin. So you can see 
in the young we have father son two male force then two daughters two female force and if you go to the other side to the yin side there is a mother and daughter and two son right so mother and daughter two yin force and two son because the energy should be balanced in the home there should be balanced energies on the yang side father and son on the yin side mother and daughter and two son in that way this is the features of trigrams in the trigram is the same feature right this is called congenital trigram so in this way if you see as per the trigram in the trigram it has been mentioned in this way then we will go there and see the first character is father right the first character is father father then the first son second daughter and the third daughter on the other side now we are coming to the mother side or the yin side so here we are telling first daughter second daughter sorry first daughter right then second son and the third son maybe it's a little difficult to understand initially only but what i want to tell you now the same thing i i would like to show you here when the yang and yin are dividing so there are one male one female one male one female are taking birth now there is further multiplication then there will be birth of two male two female this side and two male two female on this side we have given very there is a very name and heaven valley fire thunder we will be discussing the meaning of these names for right now look at this chart when there is a worth of this a trigram so we can see this the father character the meaning of father having only yang the very strong character is strong very powerful very energetic character that is father right it's written in heaven means that is father only yang 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 we can see three lines three lines only yang 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 so three lines means this upper line middle line and the lower line or we are telling this the heaven line earth line or human heaven human earth like suppose if this is the universe so this is the upper part or we can tell sky this is the middle part where humans are living and and this is the lower part earth okay we'll try understand this later on right now just come back here so there are three three lines here so what is the father character this side what is the mother character this side the meaning of mother is broken line but all are broken line means all are yin and the father all are yang then you can say other son and two daughter this side on the other side daughter and two son okay so the same thing i have represented here in this form you can see so this is the father character father 
and this is the mother character because this is the yang side and this is the yin side right and this is the so if i do the division from here there is the yang side and there is the yin side in the yang side we are having two male force one father one son this is the son and two female force so this is the daughter and this is also the daughter and if we go to the yin side so we can see this is the mother and this is the daughter so two female force other than we can see two son son and son and every one is having some meaning or right now i would like to tell you these are the eight energies eight energies right so you can also understand in that way suppose i am talking about the eight energies now i am making the empty box because to understand the box we need more time i am making the empty box this is the center core and this empty box is nothing but doing the representation of the eight energies right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 like if you are doing the treatment of the eight energy this is called eight energy system right but suppose and i can make in that way oh, i am doing the treatment of the eight energy system i am dividing in two parts 1 2 3 4 this is the yang side 1 2 3 4 this is the yin side so this is called eight energy system on the yang side we are having two male and female on the yin side also we are having two male and female so there are total eight energy in the same way like i have represented here now i am representing in this form now i can tell the six energy pattern suppose this is the circuit and i am keeping father here father is the highest yang force and i am keeping mother here mother is the highest yin force so father and mother i am keeping on the corner father i am giving okay father you don't take the part you just become the controller even i am telling the mother okay you don't take the part in the action and reaction you become the controller then what is remaining remaining three energies here three energies here so three energy this side three energy this side this is called six energy system many person doing the study of the six energy system or they are telling it six key right or six energy system which is coming from the i ching right because six energy system is actually eight energy system when father and mother become watchman they become controller not the watchman controller of the reactions the highest force then we are working on the three yang side energy three yin side energies and we are telling it six energy system right in that way when we are reaching to the this eight energy part right because we have done the division till here only right till here only now suppose if we keep on dividing this eight force suppose again i will divide the four everyone force will be giving the birth of one four force will be giving the birth of four male four female like this one yang has given birth to one yang one yin means yang and yin together given the birth of two four forces 
then they become eight forces. Then they keep on multiplying. Then in this way, when they become 64 forces, that is called 64 hexagram, but we can't jump to the 64 hexagram until and unless we understand the concept of six energy. So this is the 64 hexagram chart here. We can also make this is a 64 hexagram chart. We can see starting from zero. till the 63, total 64 hexagrams. And the 64 hexagram, we have each and every types of energies. The every energies is doing the representation of something, telling something, right? Every energy having one name, now, because this is the family of 64 person, like in our family, we are having five members. But the big family, in this one family, we are having 64 members and each member having a special power. If we are missing some power, we can ask the power from here. And everything is available. Everything is available here on. In the body, everything is available in the body. I'm not telling go and uh, or go on the hill and call the 64 yogini. All, e, e, everything is given here, but just we have to slowly and slowly be able to disclose the secret. How many person feeling difficulty? Anyone feeling too much difficult to understand? Or it's easy. Easy or difficult? Volume is very low. Volume is low. Volume is okay. Actually, this is the introduction is going on, right? We have not reached to the no problem. Actually, the thing is this generally what we are doing. We are learning directly wood, fire, earth, metal, and water. We are just, if I tell, okay, the meaning of wood is in starting, you will understand quickly. But we are trying to learn the root of that. From where these things are coming, then we will come into the five elements or the eight element, five elements also, right? So this is the concept of hexagram. So hexagram has this trigram, the eight energy concept has represented it in a different way. We, we are learning that, okay. Generally we are learning a, in a form of five elements. Okay. We are learning in the form of five elements. So this is also the expansion of the five elements. Right. The all are five elements. Expansion of the five elements. In the five elements, what we have, we have yin force and the yang force. So these are nothing but the expansion of five elements. So because we are moving very step by step. So now what I, we will do, we will start making the lines together. So how to make the line? Let's start. <clears throat> So first, you take your book, 
<clears throat> and pen and just start drawing two line one is a young line on one side this is unbroken line and on the other side yin line on the other side this is broken line now the step number 2 In the step number two, what we have to do? The step number one, one full line. One side broken line, that is a yang and yin. Now, step number two, we have to do the multiplication. So first we'll draw Two yang on this side because we are doing the multiplication of yang. So yang will be in the bottom. Yang will be in the bottom. On the other side, you make two yin. So two yin will be in the bottom. So this is the bottom line. Now we'll make the force now. So this is the male and this is the female. So male means unbroken line, female means broken line. Here also male and female. So there is a creation of the four energies, which I told Tai Yang, Tai Yin, Shao Yin, and Shao Yang. So till here we have created four energies now. Now these four energies will be giving birth to the eight energy in the next step. So we will be keeping this four energy in the bottom. So let's start from here. So look at here. So I will start from here, from the first force. Because the one force is giving word to two force. So I have multiplied in the two parts. Same, just duplicate. Then the second one. Same the duplication. Because this also will be giving the worth. I am making the base line, border line. Male and female part will come from the upper side. Then I'm making the third line. Same duplication. Then the fourth line, we can see here, same duplication here. because we don't have a space here, so I'm writing here. It's nothing but the duplication of this in two parts. This is also the duplication of this part. This is also the duplication of this part. And this is also the duplication of this part. Now, male and female. So male, and female, male, female, <clears throat> male, female, male and female. So in this way, we can see the first force is having all the male character and the last force also only the female character. So the first force is called father and the last force is called mother. So in this way, we have created eight lines. How many person understood this concept? How we created the line, anyone understood? 
Anyone understood how we are creating the lines? Because when we are looking many images, in the images, we can see the lines, lines, lines. So what is the meaning of line? <clears throat> there is a duplication. Now, even I duplicate this. First, I will make the base. Then I will create male female in the upper side. This is a duplication, right? We'll do once again. We'll be doing once again. Because there's a very, very base. The future depends on this. If I tell you this person is suffering with the asthma, let's do the planning, then you should know this very basic background. So let's see here. So this is the yang force and here is the yin force. So yang force means unbroken line, yin force means broken line. Now th this is the step number one. Now they are doing multiplication. So I am dividing this line in two parts, one and two. I am dividing yin line also in the two part. So first I am making this baseline because I'm bound to do the duplication. Now, we'll make one male, one female. One male, one female. So we can see this is the male, female. Male and female. So the two forces become four. Now four forces become eight. Again, we will do multiplication. So first I'm taking this first line twice, then the second line twice, then the third line twice, then the fourth line twice, right? Now, the finally, I will create, this is just a duplication. This is a duplication of this first one. This is a duplication of this second one. This is a duplication of this third one. And this is a duplication of fourth one. So now we'll take the male. So first, male, female, male, female, male, female, male, female. So now this is the final eight energies. We can see the three energies, just yang, 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 it is called father. And three energy, yin, 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 it's called mother. So there are total one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight energies. Now when we are seeing the charts, in the charts, we see like this. What is that? <clears throat> what is that? You can see this is the three unbroken line. This is the father. Father. And these are three broken line. This is the mother. Right? Then other than that, we can see. then we can see there are another three forces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The same we have made in the horizontal way. Now we are making in a circular way. So this is the same thing we have made the horizontal way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now same thing we are making in that way. We can see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So this is called the concept of trigram. Concept of trigram. Eight trigrams. 
this trigram concept also be made in that way. There are different, different ways to make it. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Got it? So we can see the three unbroken line. There is a father figure. Then the three broken line, there is a mother figure. And the same thing, but we have made there. Actually, we are learning the acupuncture, but we are not understanding these lines. Okay, just we are learning very advanced level, but we don't know why the lines are coming that way. So that's why we have to learn from very basics, everything, even the lines. Lines are energies. We can't, lines are energy, right? Central box is the core. Central box is the core. That is a, like in the human body, we are having core, nabi, solar plexus. It's balancing everything. That is a central core. Got it? Okay, so we'll be doing Hindi recap. We'll doing one minute break. So all the English participants, if they want to take the leave for breakfast or they want to sleep again, they can go <laughs> if they want. <laughs> then we'll do the Hindi recap. Ek minute ke baad Hindi ka recap karte. Ek minute ka samay de raha. Without tea, it's difficult. Yeah, you can have the tea. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> you can have the tea. One minute break. Okay, okay now. तो चलिए हिंदी में क्या प्रारंभ करते हैं <laughs> हमारे भारतवर्ष में ऊर्जाओं को सिखाने का एक अलग तरीका रहा है जैसे कहते हैं ब्रह्मा विष्णु महेश ये कोई भगवान है या कहीं बैठे हुए हैं ये एक अलग बात है लेकिन ये ऊर्जा को समझाने के तरीके हैं हमारे भारतवर्ष में कहते हैं कि अगर आपको सिद्धियां पानी है तो हिमालय पर चले जाइए और वहां पर चौसठ प्रकार की योगिनी रहती है वो सारे आपको सुख देने वाली योगिनी है उनकी तपस्या करिए उनको जगाइए आपको सुख भी मिलेगा आपको हर चीज मिलेगी तो हमारे भारत में क्या हर चीज को हमने सदियों हजारों सालों से हमारे ऋषियों ने सिखाया लेकिन उसको एक अलग भाषा में सिखाया ताकि लोगों को समझ में आए तो वो 64 जो वर्ड है वो बहुत ही महत्वपूर्ण है 64 फोर ऊर्जाएं है अब चीन में हम जाओ तो चीन में उन ऊर्जाओं को उन्होंने कहा है 64 फोर हेक्साग्राम लेकिन उन ऊर्जाओं की उत्पत्ति कैसे हुई उन ऊर्जाओं की उत्पत्ति हुई थी पहले कुछ भी नहीं उससे बनी दो ऊर्जाएं जिन्हें कहा यिन और याक फिर उनका मल्टीप्लीकेशन हुआ तो मल्टीप्लीकेशन होते होते फिर जो चौसठ प्रकार की एनर्जीज बनी उन्हें चौसठ हेक्साग्राम का नाम दिया तो इसी को हम कहते हैं कि ये हमारे ब्रह्मांड का सीक्रेट है जिसको जान लिया तो व्यक्ति कुछ भी कर सकता चाहे हेल्थ की बात हो या वेल्थ की बात हो इसे कहा जाता है आई चिन जब हम इसे हेल्थ को सुधारने के लिए करते हैं तो हम कहते हैं आई चिंग एक्यूपंक्चर इस सीक्रेट को देने वाले थे फुक्सी जिन्होंने आठ ऊर्जाओं की बात की और फिर आठ ऊर्जाओं को चौसठ ऊर्जाओं में बदला किंग वेन ऑफ जू ने और बाद में कन्फ्यूशियस ने इन्हें हमें सरल भाषा में सिखाया क्योंकि बहुत कठिन चीजें भले कितनी भी अच्छी हो कभी कभी समझ में नहीं आती तो कन्फ्यूशियस ने हमें सिंपल करके सिखाया उन्होंने एक बुक लिखी आईचिंग और इसमें इन सब चीजों का उल्लेख किया तो ये एट टाइग्राम एट ऊर्जाओं की रचना की गई है फुक्सी के द्वारा और आज नहीं आज से हजारों साल पहले यानी क्राइस्ट के भी अट्ठाईस साल पहले जब हम इन एट ऊर्जाओं को आठ ऊर्जाओं को जब 
हम चौसठ ऊर्जाओं में मल्टीप्लाई करते हैं तो वो इस तरह से दिखती है आप देखिए यहाँ पर चौसठ प्रकार की ऊर्जाएं दिख रही है पहली ऊर्जा यांग 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 है और आखिरी ऊर्जा केवल येन 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 छह बार और इसके बीच में पूरी ऊर्जाएं हैं इस ब्रह्मांड में पाने वाली ऊर्जा इसके बाहर नहीं है पूरे ब्रह्मांड का एक एक कण इस ऊर्जा के अधीन है हम किसी भी चीज को बना सकते हैं नष्ट कर सकते हैं इन ऊर्जाओं को मैनिपुलेट करके तो पहले तो हमें समझना होगा आठ ऊर्जाओं के बारे में तो आठ ऊर्जाओं को समझने के लिए हम पहले समझते हैं स्टेप नंबर वन जब कुछ नहीं था उससे दो ऊर्जाओं की रचना हुई यांग और यिन और इन दो दो ऊर्जाओं ने फिर से मल्टीप्लाई करके चार ऊर्जाओं को बनाया तो यांग को हम एक ऐसी लाइन से ड्रॉ करते हैं जो बीच में से टूटी कटी नहीं और ये इनको दर्शाते हैं हम टूटी हुई यानी ब्रॉकन लाइन के माध्यम से तो आप यहां देख सकते हैं जब हमने मल्टीप्लाई किया यांग से हमने एक मेल एक फीमेल बनाया और ये इनसे भी हमने एक मेल एक फीमेल बनाया तो दो मेल और दो फीमेल तैयार हो गए यानी पहले था वन मेल वन फीमेल जब इन दोनों ने विभाजित किया मल्टीप्लाई किया तो बन गए दो मेल और दो फीमेल तो जब भी मल्टीप्लीकेशन होता है मेल और फीमेल समान मात्रा में बनते हैं तभी ऊर्जा बैलेंस रहती है तो जब भी हम इन ऊर्जाओं का निर्माण करते हैं तो कैसे हम लाइंस को ड्रॉ करते हैं लाइन को ड्रॉ करने का यही सिंपल सा तरीका है कि जैसे कि हमने कहा ये स्ट्रेट लाइन जो यांग को रिप्रेजेंट करती है और ये ब्रोकन लाइन जो यिन को रिप्रेजेंट करती है अगर इनको मल्टीप्लाई करना है तो पहले आप चलिए इसको मल्टीप्लाई करिए फिर आप इसको मल्टीप्लाई करिए <coughs> तो पहली वाली ऊर्जा को हम पहले हम नीचे लिख लेते हैं और दूसरी वाली ऊर्जा को भी हम नीचे लिख लेते हैं इससे सबसे नीचे की नींव तैयार होगी क्योंकि अब यही ऊर्जा मल्टीप्लाई होने वाली है तो अब इससे बना पहला मेल और फिर फीमेल फिर से मेल मेल का मतलब है यांग यानी बिना टूटी लाइन और फीमेल तो देखिए कुल मिलाकर दो ऊर्जाओं ने चार ऊर्जाओं का निर्माण कर दिया इसी दो जो लाइन बनी इसको हमने तायांग नाम दिया ताई का मतलब होता है मैक्सिमम क्योंकि इसमें सिर्फ यांग ही यांग है कोई ये नहीं है आखिरी वाली ऊर्जा को हमने ताई नाम दिया क्योंकि इसमें सिर्फ ये नहीं ये है कोई यांग नहीं है तो मेल फीमेल फीमेल यानी शाव यन और अगेन मेल मीन शाव यांग तो हमारी चार प्रकार की ऊर्जाएं तैयार हो गई इसी चार प्रकार की ऊर्जाओं को यहां पर दिखाया गया है आप देख सकते हैं तायांग मेल ताइन फीमेल तो मेल फीमेल मेल एंड द फीमेल अब ये था स्टेप नंबर टू स्टेप नंबर थ्री में ये भी ऊर्जाएं विभाजित होंगी प्रत्येक ऊर्जा दो दो नई ऊर्जाओं का निर्माण करेगी और चार की हो जाएंगी आठ उसी आठ को हम बोलते हैं हेक्साग्राम सॉरी उसी आठ को हम बोलते हैं एट ट्राइग्राम <coughs> तो देखिए इन एट ट्राइग्राम में अगर आप देखेंगे तो तीन तीन लाइन इसलिए कहते हैं ट्राइग्राम 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 क्योंकि इसमें तीन तीन लाइन तो जब हमने स्टेप नंबर टू से हम स्टेप नंबर थ्री पर जाएंगे <coughs> तो फिर से पुनः हमें मल्टीप्लाई करना होगा तो जब स्टेप नंबर टू से हम अगले स्टेप की ओर जाते हैं तो देखिए हमें प्रत्येक ऊर्जा को दो दो भागों में बांटना है हमें पहली ऊर्जा को दो भाग में बांटना है दूसरी को भी दो में तीसरी को भी दो में और चौथी को भी दो में <coughs> तभी आठ प्रकार की ऊर्जाएं बनेंगी तो सबसे पहले हम जो 
ऊर्जा है उसका नींव लिख लेते हैं नींव वही जो ऊपर बना हुआ है ये पहली ऊर्जा का नींव है दूसरी ऊर्जा को भी कॉपी कर लेते हैं तीसरी ऊर्जा को भी कॉपी कर लेते हैं और चौथी ऊर्जा को भी कॉपी कर लेते हैं ये तो कॉपी पेस्ट हुआ अब हम बनाएंगे फर्स्ट मेल सेकंड फीमेल मेल फीमेल मेल फीमेल मेल इस तरह से हमारी एक दो तीन चार पांच छ सात आठ ऊर्जाएं तैयार हो गई तो पहली ऊर्जा प्योर मेल है जिसमें वन टू थ्री ऑल थ्री लाइंस मेल है जिसे हम कहते हैं फादर और द वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग इनर्जी और आखिरी ऊर्जा में सब कुछ ब्रॉकन है सारा का सारा यन 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 है इसे कहते हैं मदर और वेरी क्रिएटिव इनर्जी मदर इज द क्रिएटिव इसी ऊर्जा को हम इस तरह से जब दर्शाते हैं वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव इसी ऊर्जा को इस तरह से दर्शाया जाता है आप देख सकते हैं इसी ऊर्जा को दर्शाने का दूसरा तरीका वन टू थ्री और फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट वही ऊर्जाएं लेकिन ये हमने लिखने का तरीका हमारा यहां पर बदल गया <coughs> तो ये पहली ऊर्जा जिसमें तीनों यांग फोर्स है जिसे हमने कहा फादर और ये तीनों ऊर्जा हैं जिसमें सर्वियन फोर्स है जिसे हमने कहा मदर तो वही क्रम है वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट जब ये आठ प्रकार की ऊर्जाओं का निर्माण हो जाता है इसी को हम एट ट्राई ग्राम्स कहते हैं राइट आठ ट्राई इसी को दर्शाने का दूसरा तरीका ये है कि ये हमारे फादर हैं यहाँ पर जो बहुत ही स्ट्रॉन्ग है फादर फिर वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग और ये मदर हैं जो काफी क्रिएटिव हैं तो फादर से हमने स्टार्ट कर लिया वन टू थ्री फोर और वन फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट लास्ट में पहुंचे मदर के पास तो ये आठ प्रकार की ऊर्जाएं हैं जिन्हें जिनको एट एनर्जी कहा जाता है जिनको दर्शाने के अलग अलग तरीके हैं अलग अलग तरह से इस ऊर्जा को दर्शाया जाता है जैसे कि इन ऊर्जाओं को दर्शाने का एक तरीका है कि हम दर्शाते हैं मान लो एक तरफ यांग और दूसरी तरफ ये तो दर्शाया जाता है वन टू थ्री फोर फोर यांग फोर्सेस वन टू थ्री फोर फोर यन फोर्सेस टोटली आठ फोर्सेस हो गई जिन्हें एट एनर्जी सिस्टम कहते हैं <coughs> और जब इसी में हमने फादर मदर को अलग कर दिया फादर को यहां रख दिया मदर को यहां रख दिया दोनों को कंट्रोलर बना दिया और बाकी तीन तीन ऊर्जाओं को दोनों तरफ कर दिया अभी भी आठ ऊर्जाएं हैं फादर मदर और तीन ऊर्जाएं एक तरफ तीन ऊर्जा दूसरी तरफ इसे सिक्स एनर्जीज कहते हैं यानी कुल मिलाकर एनर्जी तो आठ ही है जिन्हें एट ट्राई ग्राम कहते हैं तो जो सबसे बेसिक कंसेप्ट है एनर्जीज का वो यही है एनर्जी को समझाने का जो एक बहुत ही बेहतरीन तरीका है वो ये है राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड एट जब हम टर्टल एक्चर की बात करते हैं तो टर्टल एक्चर में टर्टल की पीठ पर यही ऊर्जाएं बनाई गई हैं और इन ऊर्जाओं से सारा ट्रीटमेंट होता है ये टर्टल है टर्टल के बैक पर हमने आठ प्रकार की ऊर्जाएं बनाई राइट यहाँ पर फादर एनर्जी यहाँ पर मदर एनर्जी फिर यहाँ पर वन और एनर्जी से सारी तो आप देखेंगे जब टर्टल आई की बंक्चर की बात करेंगे 
टर्टल एक्यू पंक्चर में इस तरह का बना होता है टर्टल है कि बंजर में इस तरह से बनाता है ये ऊर्जाओं को दर्शाने का एक तरीका है लेकिन है है एट ट्राइग्राम्स ओनली जिन लोगों ने टर्टल है कि बंजर पढ़ा है उनको ये सब समझ में आता है लेकिन आप लोगों को आगे समझ में आएगा तो आज हमने बस अभी तक हमारा सिर्फ इंट्रोडक्शन ही चल रहा है इंट्रोडक्शन चल रहा है धीरे धीरे हम इसकी गहराइयों में जाएंगे तो हम बहुत ही बेसिक से स्टार्ट कर रहे हैं जहां हम समझने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं कि जब हम ये नियां की लाइंस बनाते हैं इसका क्या अर्थ है तो आज की क्लास को यहाँ पर सब विराम देते हैं अब हम मिलेंगे कल थैंक यू सो मच आज की क्लास को क्लोज कर